this was his community, a six in Market Street at the courthouse to 44 West Upsell Street, and everything in between was his stomping ground. Leon was a part of this community. Leon was a part of West Philly, but more significantly, West Philly was a part of Leon. This work of art will be here for a long time, and it will live on as an icon, as a beacon, and an incredible source of pride and inspiration. Aloysius Leon Higginbotham Jr. And I know I see a lot of you smiling, because I know a lot of you uh, wanted to know what that A period stood for. So now you know. To say that Judge Higginbotham was accomplished is a complete understatement. He was extraordinary. Every time that America faced a moral inflection point, there he was. He kept it real in 1968, the day after Martin Luther King Jr.'s assassination. He kept it real when he spoke truth to power to Lyndon Johnson in the Oval Office. He kept it real in 1982 when he went to South Africa and spoke about racial equality and got locked up by the apartheid government. In 1995, President Clinton awarded Higginbotham the Presidential Medal of Freedom, the nation's highest civilian honor. And that, after all, is what the beauty of murals is about in some way, right? They beautify our environment, we all know that but they are larger than life. They give people the dignity and respect that they truly deserve, and they help us hold on to our heroes. When you think about inspiration, Leon Higginbotham is one who can provide that. 